Hi, I'm Ryan, and this is Eleanor, my 62 Mini. If you're having trouble shifting into gear, try this trick with your clutch first. On the left side of your engine bay, we're going to take some needle nose pliers and remove this spring. Remember to put it back on when you're done. Okay, with the spring off, we're going to pull that arm to the left as much as we can with our hands. It's not going to move much at all. But there's a screw at the very bottom of that arm, and it's locked into place with a bolt. Just take a pair of vice grips and release it counterclockwise, and then you can unscrew it the rest of the way with your own hands. It'll move nice and free. So take that arm again, and you're going to pull it all the way back. And while you're pulling it back, try to unscrew that screw as much as you can. All the books say turn it one flat, just means a flat head of the screw. Turn about a sixth of a turn inward again, and that's its final resting place. Hold that screw head in place. And now that you've got it in place, take that nut and at the base of the screw and tighten it as tight as you can against the uh, engine. And that should do it for you. There's one more test where I'm pointing there's a gap. Um, go back into the car, push the clutch pedal down and have someone check for you that that gap is still there. Doesn't matter how large or small it is. If the gap isn't there and the bolt is touching the engine, then just unscrew the bolt a little bit and that should do it for you. I want to thank my friend Jack from 7 Mini Parts who gave me these tips to do. I've left a link in the description to his write-up. Thanks for listening. If this has helped you, I'd really love to hear. I'd personally love to meet anybody who likes to work on old cars too. Thank you.